boy, am I excited. Today we're gonna cook pork and it's on Mac. Look at that thing, oh my goodness. Hey, so we're just gonna light the burner here and get the chimney going, you know how I do it. I'll let that gas burner go and kind of get the bottom of the coal started. And then we're gonna turn it off here. Let's let mother nature do take her course. And here in a little bit, we just kind of look at it and when the coal's on top, get this salt and pepper color going here. It's ready. Just dump them on. Then we put us a log on. Now we're ready to go inside and look at this pork. Oh my goodness, I trimmed it up already. I removed the fat cap and any silver skin I seen and bones or anything like that. And then uh, I've got this little throwaway injector here I'm gonna use today. And you know about our injection today, you know, we had this thing we always used to do at the barbecue trailer. Well, we don't know what kind it is. <laughs> so just kind of going with it. We know it's pork. Anyway, this is our SPG for our base coat. And we're using Mr. Voigt's Pork Party for the second coat. And uh, you know, all you gotta do here is put one layer on and then put the other layer on. So we'll start here with the SPG. Look at how we injected that. Now we're uh, putting the SPG on. Put it on real even. We don't want any uh, spots that just aren't even and out, you know. And uh, once you get to that point, let it sweat. Now it's time to put on the Mr. Voigt's Pork Party for our sweet layer. And uh, while that's sweating, we're gonna go out and shut the door and set our air. You know, you know where to set yours, I'm sure. Just kind of play with it. Open our smokestack, and then we're gonna put the doors at prop. And then whenever it gets the flames going real good, we're gonna go ahead and shut this door. And uh, now we're at temp, and we're gonna go ahead and get this port butt on, sitting on the bottom rack right in the middle. It's been on for about 45 minutes. Once we get to that point, when you're cooking at 275 to 300, you always wanna flip and rotate about an hour in. It's easy, just flip them over, rotate them. And then uh, while that sits, about another 45 minutes or so, we're gonna come out here and spritz, check our temp, and uh, get all sides. You know, we wanna keep that rub going on there and emulsified. And then uh, shut the doors and get our thermometer. So we check temp and we're at 160 and on the internal temp. Now we're gonna wrap these things up. I like to uh, put two layers of foil down, put some SPG or something on there. And then I put one layer on top. And then I roll the edges here, like this here, make a little boat. And then uh, once I get that boat made like this, I'm gonna turn it around and I'm gonna fold up one end of it just kind of roll it up, flip her around, and then we're gonna pour our juice in the open end. We're using a Diet Dr. Pepper for the sugar content, cut with a little bit of water today. Try a piece here. That's the one right there. Look at that, huh? That moisture in there. <clears throat> There's another piece off the money muscle here. Man, them layers of flavor are just out of control. Look at that bite right there. 
It's going down. Mm -hmm. All right, here we go. Guys, check it out. Here we go. Let's put a little layer on top. Oh, son, look at that. Whammo. Now we're going to hit it with a little bit of our juice. What we did is we pulled all the juice out and we separated it so all the, all the grease came out of it. Now we're throwing this back on top. That's what's the, called the au jus. Oh man, look at that. Fork loves moisture, so we're not gonna get too out of control with it. Just gonna mix that in. The only sauce we put on was what hit on top of the pork butt. Just as a matter of getting some smoke and some sweet right there. Man, oh man, look at that. Oh, dude, that's money. 